Hi, I'm Dr. Joni Liu, and welcome to today's Cosmic Tidbit. It's part two of how does the collective ego control you? Well, one of the major shams that it likes to pawn on us human beings is that we are not part of nature. It demonizes nature. It wants us to be afraid of nature. The thing is, is that our animal nature is our true nature. This is our inner truth. This is where our inner truth comes from because feelings come from our body. Now there, you know, I could discuss all the chemical, biochemical reactions and all this stuff. But the thing is, is that if you have a thought, you will have some sort of reaction biochemically inside your body. But what the collective ego likes to tell you is to ignore your feelings. This is a big sham. It also tells you that your body is nothing more than a mechanical device. So for instance, your heart, it'll tell you that your heart is merely a pump, but it's not just merely a pump. No, every part of our body has consciousness. Every cell has consciousness consciousness. In fact, everything in nature, everything in the cosmos has a consciousness. So even that inanimate rock outside sitting in your backyard has consciousness. And the thing is, is that people talk about being united or having unity or we're all connected. But in fact, the collective ego has been disconnecting us from our source, which is the cosmos. So I'll be back next time with another cosmic tidbit. Talk to you later. Bye.